first of all, I'd like to just thank God. Um, God is use. Uh, you know, I'm I'm thankful for God. He's using me. Uh, to work with these young men and, and, and to glorify his name. And so that's is a blessing in itself there. So I'm thankful for that. I'm appreciative of that. Um, this Man, this team, I've told you, was special. And, and they keep showing. They keep showing. When you talk about a win like this over New Mexico State, this is huge, man. It's huge for our program. It's huge for our department. And it's huge for our university. Um, that's a seasoned team. That's an extremely large team. Um and, that, and that's a well-coached team. And to force that team into 19 turnovers, that was, you know, we hadn't did that in a while. Uh, one of the things we wanted to do is get back to being aggressive. Like we uh, kind of started the season off. Uh, we got concerned with fouls, and so we kind of backed off a little bit. But, um, man, you know, them guys there, uh, they had the chances to quit, and they wouldn't. You're talking about, man, they withstood, they, you know, they withstood run, runs by New Mexico State. Uh, our guys just fought to the bitter end, uh, and they have developed a mentality of uh, refusing to lose. Um, you know, man, that's you know one of the biggest teams that we have ever played. And then when you talk about playing a team who has really been, you know, the champs of the WAC, you know, been in the NCAA tournament for the last four or five years. Uh, you know, this is a statement, and uh, we know that they're going to be waiting for us when we go to uh, Las Cruces. But um, I was really, really proud, man, of just, you know, the guys that came off the bench. Uh, when we talk about Nate, who, you know, really, man, was, was really active and aggressive. Uh, and, and then at the end, the steal that, you know, Johnny had, and then the step up there and knock those two, three, those two free throws down to kind of seal the game. You know, that, that, that's just big, and that's just showing the maturity of our program. Um, you know, man, I, you know, we, we had, you know, 13 assists. Uh, you know, that's good for them. We had 15 steals. Those are championship numbers. Um, and this team is maturing. This team is steadily getting better. Um, this team has got some goals set for themselves. And they're doing everything in their power to try to um, reach those goals. And so um, I've never been more proud of a, of a team than I have of this team all year, man. Even when we have had some um, – not so good uh, good moments, um, but I'm extremely proud of these guys. Um, our biggest thing now is we're going to enjoy this for about an hour, and then we're going to start talking about uh, University of Texas Pan Am. And we know, you know, that team is coming in. That team is going to be uh, aggressive. That team is really, you know, desperate for a win. And so we got to uh, continue to, you know, get better, continue to focus, continue to put a game plan in for each team we face. And so now. Uh, in about 49 more minutes, so we'll be talking about Texas Pan Am. Well, what happened? Um, we made a, a few subs, and we brought extra energy off the bench. When you talk about the subs we made, we put in Nate, we put in Kirk, and we put in Johnny. And them guys are really energy guys. And, and them guys came in, and when they came in, we cut the lead. We actually took a lead with that group in. And so the other guys just kind of fed off that energy. And that's what it came down to is we started off, uh, our guys was, uh, I'm not going to say nervous, but our guys, you know, was a little, uh, a little unsure at the start. But when we made the sub and the guys came off the bench, uh, they brought that energy. We got our confidence back. And then, um, you know, we was ready to play. Uh, we had a moment there in the first half that we thought we was really about to put them away where we went up by eight and we had, a, you know, they called a tech on Matt and that kind of took the momentum out of us and, and then they had they run. But we know basketball is a game of runs and um, we knew that they was going to have runs and, and we knew we, we were going to have runs. And in the second half, um, you know, our guys really was confident. Our guys shot the shots that they know that they can make. Uh, you know, QP made his typical couple deep threes. Uh, you know, Matt made a three, and you could just see the confidence in our guys, man. And so, this team, have, you know, have showed us that all year. And, and so, it wasn't nothing new, um, but they continue to fight. They continue to get better. And like I told you, I've never been more proud of, of a team that I've been associated with um, than this team that I'm um, actually coaching now. So. We're just thankful, we we humble, uh, we're appreciative, and we just thank God just that uh, we continue to uh, develop and get better.
Well, I was kind of reading him um, the whole time out of bounds, and he I know he ain't seen me, see me because I was kind of behind his player, and it was another player to the right of me. And I seen when he was going to try to throw the pass, and I just shot the lane, and I got the steal. Well, from the first time earlier in the game, I, I just kind of went there and relaxed and went there with confidence, and I knocked him down. I know because I shot like 100 free throws before the game. So that, that, that really helped me out.